Hey you guys, it's your girl Simone and welcome back to my channel. So as y'all can see by the title, today's video will be, hold on, hold on, the lighting, okay. So as y'all can see by the title, today's video is another story time and this story time is about a new, a new, y'all, this story time is about a new ex that I'm gonna have to start telling y'all about, so yeah. As y'all can see, I got my phone in my hand, which means I'm finally using my camera after all these years, so yeah. So, Okay. Before we get started, y'all already know what time it is. Make sure you subscribe to my channel, give a thumbs up and comment down below if you haven't already done so. Let me just adjust because I just feel like... Alright. Alright, I'm good. Alright, so let's go ahead and get started. So yeah, let's get into this story. So this story took place, this was about New Year's Eve um, around that time. And I know y'all probably like, another one, y'all, another one. This is... <sighs> Like I said, I don't have the best New Year's Eve. So, yeah. So, okay. So, at this time, I was dating this boy. We're going to give him the name Enemy. And his name is going to be Enemy. He's not my enemy. But he was an enemy to everyone. Because, so that's why we're going to call him Enemy. Because it's like, every time I looked up, this boy had, would have beef with somebody. Like, y'all, it never fell. Every time I look up, it would be like, beef with him, beef with him, beef with It was fucking annoying. So, yeah. So, we're going to call him Enemy. So, yeah. So, at this time, I was dating this boy named Enemy. And before all of this happened enemy had me fucked up like y'all this was our relationship actually ended this day too anyway so enemy had me fucked up y'all like he was doing bullshit or whatever so whatever days prior i'm gonna just give y'all a little backstory so it could explain the craziness so days prior before new year's eve he had um Oh yeah, days prior before New Year's Eve, he had um, this girl that I knew had hit me up and she sent me a DM. And mind you, this isn't like my best, this wasn't like even a homegirl, like we know each other through somebody else. So this is embarrassing, y'all. Either way, go, it always would have been embarrassing. So she hit me up and she was like, hey, ain't this enemy? And I went to the page and it was enemy and another girl, y'all. He had a whole nother girlfriend. Mind you, everybody knew Enemy was my man's. Like, we was all over IG. Like, you know, but that don't mean nothing. Niggas would post you and be, you know. Enemy was so, f he, he could have been named friendly. Because Enemy used to be taking pictures with every bitch he messed with. Like, he could be just fucking with the bitch on the low. He taking a picture. Sneaky links, picture, picture. Enemy was a, f ugh, ugh. So, anyway. So, she sent me a picture. And I'm just like. Y'all, and I knew the picture was recent because it was something he had on in the picture that he had just bought. So, I'm just like, y'all, enemy got me fucked up. So, you know, I pressed the issue with enemy, y'all. This is like a story within a story, kind of, but I'll get into that other story deeper later. But, yeah, so I pressed the, in the issue with enemy. It was a whole big thing. He had me fucked up. He just basically was on some yep, oh, well type shit. Because enemy was the type of nigga that, let, that needed bitches to do for them, him and i wasn't one of those bitches so clearly he probably was like huh you ain't doing for me you got to go i guess maybe that was how it was who knows i thought we was in love though anyway so yeah enemy had me fucked up so he dating a whole nother bitch or whatever and um yeah so like just probably like a week or two before this me and mind you me and enemy was together for like eight months so it wasn't like he was my boyfriend for a month or whatever but anyway before this enemy me and my homegirls have like jumped enemy and all that so you know it was beef you know it was it was beef like i'll get to that that'll be another story too but yeah anyway so let's fast forward to new year's eve so new year's eve come and we still haven't really even been seeing each other like we ain't seen each other at all actually we would just be talking back and forth arguing because it was just like wow you know so and mind you we had just spent christmas together like bro anyway 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 so yeah so new year's eve come and he was just like um i promise because every time i'll be like i just want to talk in person and you know that talking person is bad but i back then i was a, a toxic person i'll admit that so anyway he, i wanted to talk in person so bad you know because i need you to see me where i'm coming from when i'm talking to you like i need us to see each other to see me you know so anyway so he was just like i promise he was like so tonight my homie is um having a kickback at the snooty fox y'all the snooty fox anyway so he like my homeboy having a kickback at the snooty fox fox and he was like y'all should come through so at my house it was me my sister and my homegirl same homegirl from the other story time with toxic on new year's eve she that's my dog you know well it was my dog we ain't dogs no more but yeah so anyway yeah so he was like, y'all could come through if y'all want to. So I'm like, all right, whatever. So that was like way earlier in the day. So when I was hitting him, like, so what time is it going to be? So this, that, that, that. He was like not replying. So bef um, 
what happened so anyway it was probably like around three ish whatever on new year's eve we end up going to buffalo spot so we went to the one in compton or whatever so when we went to buffalo spot we end up we was in there you know and his niggas in there or whatever so it was these two boys up in there and uh, oh sorry so yeah it was these two boys up in there and one of them let's name the one who actually approached me let's give him the name suspicious his just name gonna be suspicious because it's gonna be in more story times about him i probably got like one good story time about him and he just always gave me like straight like suspicious like he always seemed like he's up to something so we're gonna give him suspicious and the other one we just gonna name him um what could we name him suspicious and we could name the other one meg i don't know y'all thinking why i'm naming him meg I, for some reason family guy is in my head right now so meg from family guy okay so we're gonna name him meg and we go <laughs> the other one suspicious so yeah so anyway so suspicious walk up to me and he's just like oh what's up like okay da 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 da, da you know talking that shit whatever that compton shit because he's from compton or whatever so he just like um what y'all doing tonight so we like um we ain't got no plans because at this point Oh, I was gonna say his name enemy ain't hit me back so I'm just like we ain't got no plans or whatever so he like okay cool y'all want to come um me and my boy we having a, like a new year's eve party just gonna be you know uh, just homies and some homegirls it's gonna be cool so I'm like all right we'll let y'all know so we exchange number I exchange numbers with suspicious or whatever time go by still ain't heard from enemy I was gonna call him op because I was gonna name him op because he's everybody op but whatever so I still ain't even heard from enemy so whatever so my homegirl like bitch we need to just do something because the fuck we ain't gonna be waiting on him I'm like right and New Year's Eve I don't really like to go to like too much big shit because as y'all can see from the time when I was with Joe at the party that got pop 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 y'all so y'all see what I'm saying so I'm like all right so I hit up oh boy and um so i hit up um suspicious i was gonna call him buffalo spot whatever so i hit him up and i was just like hey so yeah we want to come to the party we want to come, come through so he like all right whatever so y'all want me to pick y'all up mind you i had a car so i'm just like um we can meet y'all but my friend she just like if we're gonna be too drunk like we should probably have him pick us up and i'm just like hmm, but nah i'm like nah let's just drive so my sister was supposed to come too we getting ready y'all just so happened her cycle started so she was cramping and i'm like bitch mind you her birthday was just the day before so she didn't even come so she like i'm gonna sit this one out whatever so she stayed in the house and we end up going me and my homegirl and um dang i'm not cool with her no more so i don't even want to post the picture but anyway so yeah so we end up going like my sister got us cute whatever so we end up going or whatever so when we went to go meet up with him he had us meet up at this house so we pull up to the house or whatever and he was just like parking is bad at where the kickback is gonna be at so y'all might want to get in the car with me because i got a for sure spot there so i'm like all right so we pull over we park where we was parked at and we hop in the car with him so when we hop in the car with him we drive you know to some other little neighborhood and Compton y'all we a neighborhood in Compton whatever so y'all it's just because it's like <laughs> this nigga said parking was bad so we pull up to this neighborhood y'all he's it's not like we pulled up to a neighborhood in Hearthon if y'all from LA you know Hearthon ain't nowhere to fucking park ever or Inglewood certain parks like you y'all whatever I don't know like I don't know. So we pull up to this neighborhood, y'all. And it was parking spots every fucking where. Like some people like it was like parking on the street. It was a lot of parkings on the street because it was like a lot of houses. Some people was having their parties and shit, but maybe he thought it would have got the block would have got sold up. Who knows? But at this point, it was parking. So we pull up to the house. House looked nice, you know, but it's dark as fuck. You don't hear no music come out of this house that we going to. So I'm like, oh, it's right here. He like, yeah. So mind you, it's just us, me, my homegirl, and suspicious. His other homeboy supposedly was gonna meet us or whatever like that so he and we sit in the car sit in the car he ended up coming so we stand outside he like all right um yeah so yeah it's gonna turn up y'all ready he had bottles he like all right y'all stay right here we finna let y'all in so i'm like okay so i'm like laughing with my homegirl because we stand in the front they went around back so i'm laughing with her like haha because my job the house had woods on the the house windows was boarded up so i'm 
laughed all my bitch. What the fuck? That'd be crazy if this was a bando, right? And she like, right, what the fuck? They got set the bando. So she like, I'm thinking they board she she telling me like I think they board up the windows because you know, like maybe on New Year's Eve they be shooting, like you know, so they don't want their windows to get shot out, so they board them up probably on New Year's Eve. So I'm like, okay, that's smart. That's maybe what they did. So I'm just like, all right, whatever. So we wait, we wait, we wait. They end up opening the door. So they cause they went around back to open the front door. So they open the front door. We come in. We come to this house and it's just like what a party at like you know, like what a party at because I thought it was a party here. This time it's probably like around ten. So, you know, it's New Year's Eve. I know people come to stuff late, but this it should be somebody here besides the four of us. So we walk in the house or whatever, and it's just like some folded chairs, like in the living room. Like it was a little hallway part, and then you turn, it's the living room, kitchen over there. Then go down the hallway, it's like a bathroom, some rooms, whatever. I don't know. I didn't go deep in this house. So in the living room type area, it was just like some folded chairs. No furniture in this house at all, y'all. Let me just say folded chairs, like the metal ones, and um, it was like two folded chairs and some like you could tell somebody be up in there like smoking and shit like that so i'm like looking at her she look at me we look at him i don't want to ask the question the elephant in the room like bro where's your furniture but you know so he like yeah this is my people house they out of town they let me use for the weekend i'm like oh, okay so we standing there and my homegirl was like so y'all board up the windows because they be shooting like you know and he was like, like he looked at his friend he looked at Meg, I mean, and they started laughing. And he's like, ha, yeah, you already know. Y'all know. Yeah, y'all know. So I'm just like laughing. I look at her. We start laughing like, okay, I guess we know. So so I'm just thinking like, y'all, this, this, I'm thinking in my head like this, this got to be a bando because <laughs> what the fuck? Ain't no furniture in this motherfucker. So we standing around. They like, y'all want something to drink? Y'all want some drink? So I'm like, okay, yeah. They like, let me get some cups. Okay. Um, like looking around like where would cups be um in the kitchen so you know so he like oh i got some cups in this little bag or whatever so he um pulled out some cups or whatever from the liquor store and i'm just thinking like okay they ain't trying to wash dishes so i'm just like where everybody at because at this point this is weird <laughs> so i'm just like yeah and he like oh um they come in, they come in, y'all don't trip. But we gonna have a good time. We can start drinking without everybody, whatever. So he like, dang, I wanna play some music. Mind you, yeah, the lights was on. It's not like it was dark. The lights was on in this house or whatever. So um, he like, I wanna play some music or whatever. And he like, I ain't got no speaker. So he just like, yo, I'm just standing there like, I said, how y'all ain't got no speaker and it's a party? And he was just like, ha 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 ha. Look at each other again, laugh. And I'm just thinking like okay at this point i'm not understanding like i don't get what's funny because it's like how is it a party it ain't no speakers like ain't no friends it's just weird so i'm just like okay so anyway we just talking we just getting drunk they had some hennessy or whatever we just drinking y'all i know y'all probably thinking like why the hell are y'all drinking why the hell y'all still think that this is a party why y'all not realizing this is a bando why y'all didn't run y'all i don't know so we drink or whatever and y'all when i drink i'm the one that always have to go to the bathroom so i'm like i gotta use the bathroom like you know and they, they was like oh shit and i'm like what and he's all like you gotta use the bathroom i'm like yeah i just said that i'm like can I use the bathroom and he's just like um hold on let me see hold on let me see so i'm thinking like what do you mean let me see ain't nobody else here you said it was us here and we waiting for the partiers or whatever so he goes to the whatever um he goes in the in the bathroom and he came back and he was just like let me know this meg talking he like let me know you was raised in the hood or you was raised in the suburbs and i'm like what and he was like you know how to um force flush a toilet so i'm just like yes like you know like i know how to do that but why you didn't just say that like why you had to ask the question because either way it goes if i didn't know how to do it you was gonna have to do it for me and it's not like i'm gonna go take a shit like i just gotta pee bro so i'm just like yeah he's like okay yeah because the um toilet be tripping he's like as a matter of fact you don't even gotta do that he was like just put the tissue in the trash can and don't flush it like i'll i'll handle it so i'm just like okay y'all and y'all so i went to the bathroom you know went to the bathroom i tried to cut the water on no water the water's not on 
the water is not on so maybe i don't know maybe hmm well i guess your family cut the water off when they leave to board their windows up and cut the water off so at this point i'm just like yo and in the bathroom it wasn't like mind y'all even though this clearly as y'all can see or i'm getting to this was clearly a bando but the house was not like dirty you could just tell be like people up in there drinking smoking and shit like that but it wasn't like filthy like it wasn't like homeless camp like it wasn't like skid row or nothing like that like it was it was a decent house like probably these people recently got like moved or something i don't know but i don't know so yeah so i'm like the water don't work so i'm just like but y'all i always keep some wet wipes with me so i'm just like wiping my hands with my wet wipes so i go back out i didn't even say nothing about that water not working because who am i to come back in there and be like hey y'all i know y'all water off like you know i didn't finna do all that clearly he knows water off whoever's water is off at this whoever's house this is so anyway so we getting drunk with these people y'all mind you time is going by time is going by this time he like yeah y'all want to know something and meg like y'all want to know something we like what he like y'all guess who my cousin is y'all never guess who my cousin is so we like who's your cousin we all drunk as fuck and he like my little co my cousin is little saint and we like oh little saint y'all i ain't never even seen stump the yard <laughs> so they all excited so i'm like okay little saint that's his cousin oh, y'all so they all little saint and we I don't know why we in a circle huddle like this. Like, do it for little Saint. Do it for little Saint. We drunk as fuck, all of us, just on some bullshit. Like, and then they start fake dancing, and I'm like, oh, like you know. And I'm over here telling this lie. I always tell people that I was in the movie Rise, and they like for real. And then I'm like, no, <laughs> I don't know. It's just dumb. But anyway, so we they like do it for little Saint. We just the whole time talking about little Saint. He like. So he like, Lil Saint gonna come. And we like, oh, Lil Saint coming tonight. Mind you, I said we got there at like 10. At this point, it's like 11. It's damn near close to midnight. Lil Saint ain't coming to this house. Ain't nobody coming to this house. <laughs> Nobody's coming to this house. So, y'all, so we just drunk as fuck. And the and Suspicious start playing music on his phone. Mind you, y'all, even though this was a crazy-ass situation for us to be in this bando. And this is not even close to the near, end of this story. But this, even though this was a crazy situation for us to be in this bando, they was good. They was a good time. They wasn't on no bullshit. They wasn't trying to, like, do nothing crazy. Like, they, it was a good time. Like, we really was drunk as fuck doing it for Lil Saint all night. Because after he said Lil Saint was his cousin... That was what we talked about the whole night is doing it for Lil Saint, getting doing what we had to do for Lil Saint. You know, that's it. That's all we I swear that would be the whole time. It would be like, pour me another cup for Lil Saint. Let's drink this for Lil Saint. <laughs> like it was it was crazy. So then next you know, suspicious was like, Hey, that nigga Lil Saint having a party at his condo downtown or some or in Hollywood somewhere, he said. And they like, we should go, we should go. He like, right, but we having a party here. And I'm like, oh, and we just like this. The countdown happened. We countdown and for little saying it was just too much to where i i'm just so fucked up and i'm just like you know what is is we play musical chairs with the chairs because mind y'all it's only two chairs i'm not sitting on the floor i just don't want to sit on the floor it was cold as fuck in there y'all oh mind y'all they did have a little space heater they brung out um but it wasn't a big one so it was like you sit in front of the heater but we have to share the chair it was just it was too much so it was cold so after the countdown i'm like all right i'm gonna go home after we hear the gunshots i'm like hey if you jump back to my car <laughs> we gonna go home we gonna call it at night so he like oh, okay all right but we have fun you know like we have fun so we still like to leave out of the house this didn't make no sense so to leave out of the house they had to leave out first through the back door and then they came around to the front open the door mind you we could have just unlocked the door and all went out the front but i don't know maybe they had to do something in the back first i have no idea so he drove us back to our car we went home boom so when we get home my sister she's up um and she's i'm telling her like oh we on our way we i text her whatever so she's up she's in the den and she just sitting there watching tv and my homegirl she was like i'm tired she went straight to bed so we um so yeah we up in there or whatever like i'm talking to my sister and i'm just drunk as fuck talking to her and i'm still telling her that Oh, that's what made me want to go home too, y'all. My bad. Enemy had texted me and was just like, where you at? Like, come through to the party. So that's really another reason why I wanted to go. Because I'm like, I don't care. It's midnight. It's a new year. It's a new day. But I need to still have this conversation with you <laughs> right now. So, yeah. So when we got back, I'm just talking to her. Because when I hit him, I'm like, all right. I brung her back. And I'm telling my sister, you know, just telling her to run down everything. And she just like, all right, well, I feel better um if you want me to come with you and i'm like yeah come with me like come with me and it's funny because i'll be drunk as hell talking to her she's like bitch i didn't even know you was drunk like i can't even tell and i'm just like right 
anyway so she's like i'm gonna come with you so my homegirl was out of it so she's like i'm gonna stay so i'm like all right so mind you when we was at the other place my homegirl put her phone in my purse so i just grabbed my purse my keys and we left but um y'all when i was finished pull out the driveway guess what happened to me my brakes my car would not stop my brakes just went out so i had to put a mercy brake i'm like what the fuck so i neutral the gas back I mean, neutral the car back to the spot I was in in my driveway and was just like, um, can you come get us? Like, call an enemy. Like, can you come get us or whatever? He didn't have no car, but his homie had a car to his lit. So I'm like, can y'all come get us because my car's tripping? I'm like, and plus I'm drunk, like, da 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 da. So he like, all right, I'm gonna come get y'all, whatever y'all gonna come. So enemy pull up, we hop in the car. It's him, we gonna call his homeboy, um, Sleepy sleepy and um it was yeah so it was enemy sleepy and then me and my sister so they put we drive back to the snooty fox the whole time me and him kind of like arguing in the car not too much arguing like but it was just like kind of going back and forth so this part we gonna get crazy y'all so we pull up to the snooty fox <laughs> i know right so we pull up there and um when we get in a row, it was actually nice. That was my first time ever being at the Snooty Fox, y'all, by the way. So, it was actually nice at the jacuzzi room and stuff. I'm like, oh, okay, this is cool, I guess. So, party, kickback. Unless, maybe they kicked everybody out. Because at this point, it's like 1 in the morning. Maybe they kicked everybody out. But in that room, it was just enemy, sleepy, and then we're going to call the other boy. The other boy. He don't need no name. It was just them three there. So, now it's me, them, and my sister there. So, I'm just like party i could care less about a party because anyway i need to talk to him so we talking we talking whatever and he's high as fuck i ain't even gonna say drunk he's high out of his mind high high and not just off of weed y'all high out of his mind tripping tripping y'all so he tripping on me and i'm tripping on him because i'm just like what the fuck and he like that's not my bitch and i'm not cheating on you blah 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 them bitches oh and i'm just like that bitch is not oh and we getting into it like y'all mind you sleepy over there passed out sleep my sister over here on her phone like this and the other boy is just the other boy over there and I'm just like, we just yelling back and forth. It had like a little, like, so we buy where the little sink area is. If you ever been there, I don't know. So we buy there, we just yelling, ah, like yelling back and forth. So at this point, I'm just like, oh, it's cool, it's cool. So I'm like going through my phone, like, you know, and I'm just like, um, what's it called? Text me, um, suspicious text me. So I'm texting him back like, oh, yeah, tonight was fun, thanks, blah, blah, blah. So I'm sitting there. Um, I end up sitting down. Yeah, so I'm sitting down and he like come behind me or whatever. And he's reading me, text somebody. So oh sorry so he's reading my phone me texting somebody so he grabbed the phone on my hand and was all like pop and throw it on the ground y'all people love breaking my phone so, so he threw my phone on the ground and i was like what the fuck is wrong with you la, da, da, da. so i picked my phone up it wasn't like broke broke but it was kind of like the screen was black i couldn't see nothing so i was just like blah blah he was tripping on me like getting closer to me so at this point he used to be so scared of my cousin or whatever so i'm just like oh, i'm gonna call my cousin right now like i'm gonna call him to come up here like you got me fucked up and he like no no you need to just go i'm like well y'all need to take us home like y'all bring us here and he's just like so, and he like um i'm like okay well if you don't want to take us i'm like then i'm gonna call my cousin to come get me and he like no no it's cool we're gonna take you and he doing the most so he like I, then he like getting into with me and i'm over here like still trying to go through my phone or whatever and mind you he had called somebody on my phone y'all he called my, my i didn't have my grandma number store for some reason not the one i live with but my other grandma and for some reason he called her fucking number and hung up she ended up telling me like somebody called me but yeah so y'all so um i'm just like yo what the fuck so we getting into it we in each other face like this at this point my sister sit like she up she like okay hold the fuck up so we getting into it we like da, 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 da. and he pushed me like he pushed me and my sister i know y'all probably like bitch why are you like he pushed me with a smile but no it ain't it ain't like that it's just this is this part getting funny to me not that part but yeah so he pushed me my sister got up and she pushed that nigga so hard like he fell she was like don't you ever y'all i be every nigga up in this room she turned into the hawk y'all i be in nigga up in this room you don't put your hands on my motherfucking sister you got me fucked up got me fucked up nigga mind you they was cool she ain't drunk none she said don't play with her sis don't play about her little sister period but anyway she like you got me fucked up and he was like, i would never put my hands on her i would never do no shit like that and she just like no because i don't give a fuck about none of that shit and his homeboy sleepy got up because sleepy at this point he was asleep but he's like now just like out of it like what the fuck is going on 
so he like um walking around and he looking mad because he just woke up or whatever and she was like yeah because i'll beat any nigga up any nigga up sleepy just walked by looking at her like he didn't say shit the other boy didn't say shit either he just sitting there nobody saying nothing y'all so it was just chaos and then what's it called so i'm drunk mind y'all i'm still drunk as fuck it was like a cup <laughs> it was a cup and um it was like yeah, it was a cup or whatever so i picked it up and i'm so drunk i could i'm seeing the, everything is you here but you really there I, it was that so when he walked by i was so mad that he put he hit he um pushed me so i picked the cup up and i threw it like i threw it at his head y'all why did he sleepy in the head why the cup hit sleepy in the head and sleepy was just like what the fuck and he was like this and she was like nigga don't you talk don't turn up nigga don't turn up i'm just like bro and i'm just like laughing i don't know why i'm laughing and sleepy just sat on the bed looking mad holding his head and the other boy just sitting there and he just like man all right y'all gotta she gotta go y'all you gotta take them home like and he like man what the fuck all right i just woke up like he was just like no nah, like she turned up and I'm just like calm down to my sister I'm like they don't want no problems with us they don't want no issues with us and um the other boy just sitting there like still just sitting there and sleepy was like man nobody is trying to fight y'all nobody's trying to do nothing you just threw a cup at my head he was like and I'm not even mad like you just and she just like oh because I don't give a fuck like I'm just like oh chill chill they don't want no issues they don't want no drama so I'm telling my sister I'm like you know what call um call my cousin call this person like they gonna come pick us up and he like no nah, we gonna take y'all because he like you know who her cousin is this little enemy was telling him like you you gotta take her home you know who her cousin is you don't want him to come up here you don't want him to come over here and she was he was just like i'm gonna take them but i just woke up <laughs> like i'm getting cups thrown at my head and it was just bad so y'all this was a dumb toxic move that i made i fucking shouldn't have did this because this was unnecessary so um i used to have like little stuff he bought he borrowed from me so i had this watch and i remember one time he had worn my watch for like or whatever and um i had my watch at home y'all but i just was not trying to go home i'm like we haven't even got through this conversation <laughs> like we've been arguing no i need to stay here we need to sober up you need to sober we need to talk like you know that's how i felt so i was all like okay i'm done with you we ain't never gonna talk ever again i said but i want my watch and he was like you want your watch my dude's probably like two in the morning now he like you want your watch i'm like yeah it's at your house I, I want my fucking watch back he like man bro take me to her house get her watch and take her home mind you he lived on the other side of town like he lived far so we in the car <laughs> y'all mind you my watch is at home the whole time i knew this so we in the car somebody gonna say something about me oh well though no. I was young so anyway we in the car y'all i'm still drunk and he's talking she like yeah and that's why that's my bitch and she this and she that and she older than you and she that she that y'all I started boom, boom, boom. I started kicking the back of the seat. My sister was like, "Stop!" And Steve was like, "Man, can you stop? Like, is can you stop?" But I'm not kicking the driver's seat. I was kicking the passenger seat. And he's like, "You stop!" I'm like, "I'm sorry." I was like, "I'm so sorry. I'm sorry." Like I was so drunk. I'm just sitting there. I'm like this, and he was just like yeah this <laughs> so from the back see y'all seen baby boy when um melvin came behind jody and was like this this was me i'm in the back seat i'm like this <laughs> he's like what the fuck my sister was like someone just sit down just sit down i said no i want to talk to you i'm like and i know y'all probably thinking like and you be saying these other niggas is great no i'm not crazy y'all i'm not i was drunk and I don't get drunk like that no more. So I was just like, I want to talk to you. We have to talk. And he was like, I try to talk to you. I'm just like, no, you didn't. Like, we just arguing and sleepy. Just look sleepy as hell, mad as hell driving. So we get to his house. And I sit in the car. He's fine. He looking for that watch or whatever. And I'm just in the car. I was just telling my sister. I'm like, I'm not doing this shit no more. And she's like, bitch, you should have been stopped doing this shit. And Sleepy was like, yeah, because this is not. I don't know y'all. I mean, like, you know, talking about me. Like, and my sister. He's like, I don't know what y'all got going on or whatever. But this this isn't it. This is not it. And I said, I'm so sorry. And at this point, I'm like, I'm sorry. And I told my sister, like, rub his head. Like, rub his head. And now, so I was like, oh, okay. So it was a phone on the middle part. I'm like, he left his phone in the car. Since he broke my phone, I got the phone. I started smashing it like, bah, bah, bah. And Sleepy was like, what the fuck are you doing? That's my phone. And I was like, I lifted it over. And I looked at the screen. And I said, oh, I'm sorry. And I set it down. And he was just like, when I was like, Sleepy, you hate me? Do you hate me? And he was like, I don't hate you. You just drunk. You need to calm down. I'm like, I'm sorry, Sleepy. Look at my job. I don't know this man. I ain't never met this man. Y'all, I'm just apologizing. Like, I'm Sleepy. I'm so sorry, y'all. I did not, Sleepy, I did not try to break your phone. He's like, I, 
I was okay. I get it. Like, I'm like, no, sleepy, because no, like, y'all. And I felt so bad because I'm like, why every time I'm trying to do something to the enemy, it's happening to sleepy? Maybe he should stay his ass asleep. So, he ended up coming back. Like, I can't find a watch. I'll give it to you another time. I'm like, okay, it's cool, whatever. So, I'm like, take us home. So, we on the way home. We on the freeway. They playing music. At this point, I'm just in the backseat chilling. Just letting it be. It is what it is. Y'all, why I have my homegirl phone around this time? I didn't have no Snapchat. I didn't know how Snapchat worked. None of that. So, I'm, um, and her boyfriend kept calling, but I wasn't going to answer the phone because I'm like, um, she not with us and i didn't want him to get mad like okay where the fuck she at oh she passed out drunk oh what the, like you know i didn't want to answer none of them questions i'm already drunk so y'all why i didn't know how snapchat work i'm over here recording on her snapchat like us in the car like not of us but out the window like with the music playing and posted on her snapchat and um then i posted like um something yeah like just the music and then i posted like a selfie and then y'all then her boyfriend was sending stuff on snap and i was opening it and i didn't know like it disappeared and i didn't know that they could see i opened it so he was hot like he cussing at this point like what the fuck like really cussing her out and i'm just like yo he's mad and i'm just telling my sister she don't know how, like we both didn't know how to use snapchat this around snapchat like first came out so we both didn't know how to use snapchat so we both just like oh she like i'm like should i reply like and say like it's me or say like she's sleep and she was like uh-uh don't reply like you know because i'm gonna say she's sleep but i'm posting in the car like so yeah we ended up going back home or whatever i told her she was cool her, her man was cool he was like why some old dumb ass didn't just say it was her and i'm just like i don't know like <laughs> y'all but yeah y'all that's the fucking story that new year's was just so that shit was a mess and when i tell more stories about enemy because when y'all gonna see why his name is enemy because i swear we used to be in some shit because like i said everybody hated him and it was just crazy because it would be people telling me like people hitting me up like you fuck with the enemy and they'd be like bro you we not even friends for you to be telling me that i fuck with the enemy like huh uh, huh y'all <sighs> yeah so anyway yeah if you know if you know who if you know me or if you've been like we've been following each other on instagram or whatever for a long time you probably most likely already know who this person is but um yeah so yeah that was the story y'all if y'all haven't already done so y'all already know what to do make sure you subscribe to my channel give a thumbs up comment down below i'm looking at my camera and i see it say it got five minutes left so that's probably what i miss i, I like how clear it looks like i can see myself i look real clear only thing on my phone is like i could record a whole hour and i'll be good so i'm thinking now what i'm gonna do is i think i'm gonna record my story Story times on my phone and other stories i'll just i mean other shit i'll just use my camera for because i think it only really gave me like i think this is only like 35 minutes or something i don't even know but it was a cool amount of time because i'm already done anyway but yeah as y'all can see look i don't know if y'all can see it is 12 33 so i'm gonna Try to edit this, upload it, so I get up to y'all tomorrow. Yeah, so if you haven't already did so, thank you for tuning in. Make sure you subscribe to my channel, give it a thumbs up, and comment down below. It's my birthday weekend, y'all, and I got a lot of story times. I, it's my, sorry, it's my birthday weekend, and my birthday vlog is going to be lit. I'm going on a trip next week. I, okay, that's too much. I, I'll be back. Thank you.